that's only going to grow the later in the race we get. But, but Allen, the level of danger. Caution, trouble, Ed Jones. Off of turn two. Last year, such a spectacular performance as a 500 rookie, qualified 11th, finished third. Said this year, everyone's been chasing a feeling that just doesn't exist in this car, myself included. I was That's just, not the feeling you wanted. I was just finishing, I was trying to finish a sentence before that accident happened, saying the level of danger trying to get past cars in those first two laps or first four or five corners is way higher than when it's just a battle one on one with somebody else because there's so many things that can go wrong. Now I'm looking forward to see what happened because it's, the tires are the inside tires that are broken, not the outside tires. So Jones out of his car, walked away toward the top of the screen. Wow. Oh, oh that's just loose. It's gone yeah. by the middle of the turn. He's not around anybody. When the back end comes around like that, it's called oversteer. So we're not sure if something broke or if the car was just loose going in to create that oversteer. But now on board, let's ride along and listen. Wow. I'm starting to wonder, guys, if maybe something didn't break there because it was just a very quick little movement in the car. I that are a very loose race car, and that's when the back end wants to come around, like I mentioned. And you become the passenger, Eddie, at that point he, in time, and very early in the race. Very right. disappointing. He was in a lot of dirty air and very low on the track when that happened. was running in 24th position at the time. And so the yellow flag out for a second time in this race. And this is what we talked about. 